Hey guys, I've been playing around in my big bat with um, a pack of bow bats, and I think I probably need to restart this so you can see the start of it because kind of important how you do it. Uh, the, this is my TH11. I've been playing around with this ever since I saw Carbon Fan do it, and you can see I put the uh, I put the balloon. And an Electro. An Electro takes 30 places, but he's such a good channeler if you know how to use him right. And see, the balloon's just to pick up any black air mines that are down. And see, that Electro Dragon is going to chain through and get a bunch of those. Now, I am running this without my King because he's upgrading. I really do want to get him to um, 60 as, as quick as I can. But anyway, the queen's down there, and what I'm trying to do is set the channel so that I can send my siege engine right into the town hall there. And for that end, I'm going to put a giant down over here with the two wizards that I have. I put those in just a little bit late, but it actually worked out. See, the cannon tanks and wizards are able to get some of that trash cleaned up so I have a clear channel over there. So Anyway, put the P.E.K.K.A.s down and then put my bowlers down. Got my warden down too. Now the warden's important. See, I've got a single to go through. And then that town, that town hall with the big bomb. See, hit the warden ability. Okay, now I'm going to put my bats in. Bats do not respond well to wizard towers and multi-infernos. Now you can see I waited until that wizard tower was engaged and the multi was engaged to release the bats. Now, fully maxed out bat spells are nearly OP at this level. And you can see they're just running through and grabbing everything. Notice I do have a freeze. That freeze is for that wizard tower and that multi. Although I'm having to pop it off right there to save as many bats as I can. And all the defenses are down now and now it's just clean up. Now here's another thing about the bat spells you need to be aware of. They do a real good job with the cleanup. But one black air bomb can take them out completely black or red it really doesn't seem to matter and you'll see it over here now in this case the best the base was already wrecked but see you have that red air seeking mine and it just blew them all away like i said in this attack we were done anyway now, I have been playing with Pekka Bobat on this base. Let's look at our war log. I, and we lost that one by two. But these are two that I did with the uh, Pekka Bobat. It seems to work really well. I was having a drop for this one. He does not have any Infernos. But the same process holds. You want to get the channel set. And I put the king down to tank for that wizard tower, so I at least get one down. And queen does the other wizard tower. Now with bats, you don't. You want to get the wizard towers down if you can, because the bats will vaporize with one hit of the wizard tower. So using bats really is a matter of um, a matter of knowing when to put them in and where to put them in, and it's something I've been practicing for a while on my big base. And you can see on this one, so I set the channel. I've got that cleaned in, got the poison down. I have it just by the back of my head. Care of that. Mm -hmm. 
Well, that baby dragon is still doing work up there. Because I, I, I really think I could erect this base without the bats. You know, looking at it now. But see that wizard tower is... and do this one. Now this one was a TH-11. No infernos, no eagle. Makes it easier, but still you have to be careful on these. See, now I'm setting the channel. In this case, I had no other use for the giant since the baby D's had done such a good job. And now here come the bowlers. I should have put the pekkas down first. There they go. Poison's down. Everything's going in. Rage. Okay, Electro will be down. Okay, there's two more Wizard Towers going down. Big bombs are just wow. And the bats go in over there. All Wizard Towers are down. Now it's just point defenses and air Ds. Which... Bats can overwhelm, and you notice how I just put a freeze on that while I had it. And one more freeze, except I didn't get both of them. But yeah, everything's down now. All defenses are down. Now it's clean up. So I'm finding out that Pekka Bobat is quite an amazing strategy if you play it right. At basics, what you want to do is get the queen, get the CC, and get the wizard towers. If you can get that, then you should be...